So this is my 76 Chevy G10 boogie van. It's lowered front and rear. I've done a lot of work to it. It's a 350 with a 350 transmission. I've had this van about a year and a half. Drive it everywhere. Um, how I lowered it is I bought new G20 springs. I think they were AC Delco springs and I cut two and a quarter rounds out of them to lower the front. I'll put up some pictures of when I first got it and what it used to look like. Um, there's not a lot of information on these things, especially not lowering them. You can buy C10 lowering spindles, but it pushes your wheels out about a half inch, which causes clearance problems. Um, the lakeside pipes on it. In the rear, all I done was I took the helper leaves out of the leaf springs. These springs were pretty shot anyway, um, but it actually doesn't ride too bad. It bottoms out quite a bit on the interstate, but nothing horrible. So on the inside, we've got a full queen size memory foam bed. I'm six foot tall, I can't sleep side to side. So that's why I wanted the long bed. Um, there's storage under the bed. Got my little thrift store cabinet. Has two swivel seats, front, both front seats swivel all the way around. I've got my little nine inch metal flake steering wheel. Little shift knob I got from a swap meet, CB radio, standard Hula Girl, and bobblehead dog. Air conditioning. It does have a sunroof. It does not leak. I fixed the leaks on it, so it doesn't leak anymore. Gold carpet. <clears throat> the side part storage cup holder that I found at a junkyard van. Um, the, the stuff on the window is a film that I got off Amazon. It's like a static clean film, cling film. So it comes off or goes back on pretty easy. Like I said, I drive this van everywhere. Runs pretty good. It's got an AutoZone 350 crate motor that I do not recommend, but it's still all right. It's got an aluminum intake. Can't really see much, but aluminum intake quadrajet carburetor. Pretty much everything on this van is new. It's a good ride. Those are, I got those OEM. These are from the 80s. Fog lights, the metal, not plastic cheap ones. I couldn't wait to get those out of the box. But it's a fun van. Got any questions, leave them below. Thanks.